I have no idea why sports games exist. For me, video games are about entertainment and escapism. I can play sports in real life. I don't want to, but I can. I can't shoot aliens in real life. Or people. I mean, I could, but then I'd have to enlist in the US Border Patrol. Racial tensions aside, let's take a look at the evolution of one of the biggest sports game franchises to ever exist and see where it came from and how it's doing today. Let's go! Back in the good old year of- <sighs> Oh, that's good shit. 1988, a young, handsome chap named John Madden wanted to make more money. And guess what? So did the lizard people at a little startup you may have heard about called EA Entertainment. So the lizard people at EA had John Madden artificially inseminate an empty laser disc and nine months of development later, out popped John Madden football. And it didn't do too well because people didn't exactly have fine motor control back in the 80s. <sighs> Oh, right there. Ugh. Get it? Because they did cocaine! So what did Madden and the Lizard people do to improve their game? Well, they spent the past 28 years dumbing down each installment of the game only to improve it with the next edition, adding in revolutionary features such as making kicking harder, adding a faint line so where the ball guy is heading, and Charles Davis! All things that should have probably come before, I don't know, the most recent edition of the game? Yeah. So that's where Madden's at right now. But at least the graphics have improved. I've been James Kukon, this has been Segment Next. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and pay homage to the lizard people. Good night!